a football player kicked a 41 yard punt. So this is the, the length of it this way, 41 yards. The path of the ball was modeled by uh, this equation. So this is a quadratic where X and Y are measured in yards. So this is gonna be the height and this is gonna be the distance of the ball. So the parabola is gonna be going like this and the equation, this equation, is modeling where the ball physically is. Sometimes we put time down here, um, but, but, but we're not in this case. We're actually measuring like physically where the ball is. So this spot right here is where it's gonna hit the ground again. Right, and so this spot is going to be its highest point. What is the maximum height of the ball? So we're looking for one of these numbers, the x or the y. If we're looking for the maximum height, well, we're going to be looking for the y. So we're going to be finding the vertex, and then we're going to look for just the y-coordinate of the vertex. The x-coordinate of the vertex will tell me how far it traveled horizontally when it was at its maximum height. Because again, this is not time like, like it's been in some of our problems. And so this is a calculator problem, so we're going to use the calculator. So go to y equals, clear out whatever you have in there, and let's type this one in. Okay, double check and make sure that you've got the negative and you've got all the decimal places where they need to be. Um, again, if you want to if you want to reset your, your viewing window, go to zoom and then go down to number six, zoom standard. And we may or may not be able to see the whole thing. It looks like not. So it looks like we need to extend my X um, by quite a bit. So if this is 10, 20 may not be enough. I may go all the way out to 40. And I'm going to make my Y's go up as well, maybe, maybe to 40 as well. So I'm going to go to my window, my, leave your minimum alone, just change the maximum to 40, and I'm going to change my scale to count by fives, just so I have fewer little marks along the axes. Leave your Y minimum, change your Y maximum to 40 as well, and your Y scale to five as well. And then hit graph again. Okay, so now we can see almost the whole thing. I'm not sure if we're going to need that point, because again, we're just looking for the vertex right now for the first question. So let's go into second, calculate. This vertex is a maximum, so we're going to select maximum. I'm currently on, here's the vertex right here. So I'm on the left of it. I'm going to go ahead and hit enter. Now I need to go to the right of right here, so I'm going to go over here. Okay, now I'm to the right of the vertex. Hit enter again. One more time. So the vertex is, we're going to call that 2015. So the vertex is 2015. But remember, the, it's the y coordinate that is the height. So we are going to just record that the, the maximum height of the ball is 15, um, and we're being measured in yards. So 15 yards is the maximum height of the ball. Okay, question B. The player kicked the football toward midfield from the 18-yard line. So we're not starting at zero here, really. So if we're on a football field, this is going to be a really skinny football field, there's the 50-yard line. The, the kick was starting at the 18-yard line. Right? The kick was starting here, and it was going wee like that. Over which yard line was the ball when it was at its maximum height? So we're still looking at that vertex. And remember that vertex was the point 2015. So the height here is 15, but this X amount is 20. All right, so it, it, was, it traveled 20 yards horizontally before it got to the maximum height, and then it would have traveled another 20 horizontally before it hit the ground. So it would have been a total of a 40 yard punt, um, but we're only concerned with that one spot right there. So over which yard line was the ball when it was at its maximum height? Well, if we started at 18, this is 18 yards, and then we went another 20 horizontally. That means that we were at the 38-yard line when it was halfway. So again, the whole punt would have been 40 yards, and so if you had added the 40 to the, to the 18, the ball would have actually touched down at the 58-yard line, uh, but it was, it was punted from the 18-yard line.